There was a time when I was trying to do three what are probably full-time jobs at once. I tended to have what is clinically uh, maybe diagnosed as codependency. With the level of isolation, the level of stress, um, cross-cultural stress, it's super easy to, to get burned out and to just want to quit. I've been in mission field for almost 20 plus years. And it came to a point, didn't feel like I want to be a missionary any longer. So I think somebody from home in Australia said that seven kilometers away from your house there is a retreat happening. Why don't you guys go there? The well is in place, we came back to life. Counseling, debriefing on a regular basis at the well is really making it possible for me to do this on a longer term basis. In Proverbs it is full of wisdom saying that it is wise to actually seek out counsel and I think the well has really been able to provide that also, just that person that is wise counsel mirroring back to you and we don't need to be ashamed of needing help sometimes to seek the Lord. I really appreciate the well not just for providing such fantastic counseling here in Chiang Mai but for also having a diversity of services that are really helpful. There is this help here for everyone and it is not a sick place to go. It is the place for every missionary when they feel that they need a bit of recharge, refreshment or rejuvenation that they can just come here and there's somebody to listen to them. The well is really a bright spot of help and hope and healing. It's okay <laughs> if, if I'm already depressed or anxious or whatever, but you know, why wait? Why wait until then? We are all broken, and I think the faster we admit we're broken and need help, the faster the Lord can do healing in our lives, and the more He can use us, the more vulnerable we can be, the more glory we're going to give to the Lord. 